just, I feel like if these were real, I would go into a relationship with them. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Yes, we're in November now. Yeah, boy. Oh my god, never do that again, Meg. Never do it again. This is my birthday month. It's actually my birthday on bonfire night, so get ready for some birthday videos. It's my 21st, so probably the biggest birthday of all time. So just to walk you through my outfit today, I'm legit in full lazy day mode. I've got these grey joggers and my dad's extra extra large grey puma hoodie. So today I'm repping the, you know, lazy day wear, I don't know. Okay, so for today's video it is yet another recommendation roundup. Now I'm pretty proud of myself because I've done one every month, which I'm really proud of because I, I don't really stick to things, I'm really like unorganised as much as I try to be organised. So yeah, uh, we are in the month of November now, so what better time to do a recommendation roundup for everything I have been loving throughout October and would like to recommend. Again, just to let you know, this is legit just a monthly favourites, but with a fancy title. <laughs> it makes more sense because I'm recommending them, I'm not just saying, this is what I've loved, do you know what I mean? So yeah. So yeah, let's get straight into it. Okay, so I'll start with the more beauty-ish kind of things. I think there might only be one. Oh no, there's two beauty things, so I'll tell you about those. The first one is a Nivea lip balm, and this has just been incredible. I have not been taking care of my lips properly enough. I have not been moisturising them and giving them proper lip care, so I decided to go out and buy just the quickest lip balm I could. And I normally go for the Vaseline brand, but this time I went for Nivea lip balm. If I'm going to be totally honest, I thought it was the Vaseline lip balm, but you know, it was the Nivea one. So I thought, what the hell, I've bought it, let's give it a try. And it's been incredible. It really makes your lips feel really taken care of and hydrated, and they stay soft for like, I'm not going to say the whole day because I feel like I'd be lying, but like a lot of the day, maybe half of the day, they're really moisturised, and then you can just whip some more on at lunchtime, after your lunch. So yeah, I would definitely recommend this, because it's done wonders for me and I've been using it pretty much every single day. Okay, moving on to the next beauty product. It is actually this gorgeous luminous face primer and you put this on just before your foundation and it really brings like a glow to your face and makes it look really soft and highlighted but in a very subtle way. And this is called the L'Oreal Lumi Magnique Base Primer and I got it in the Pure Light Primer because my face is so pale you can't really tell with the foundation I have, but like, it's not so pale, but it's like pretty damn pale. So I got that one and it's just amazing and I would definitely recommend it. I find that I don't really break out in spots that much when I use this um, primer. I don't know whether that's because of the primer or because I've been drinking more water or what, but it really is an amazing primer. So I definitely recommend that. Okay, so that was it for beauty things. This one is kind of like self-care. I don't know whether you'd put it in the beauty category. So the next thing is actually bath salt. And this is just pure bath salt. It's from the brand West Lab Pure Mineral Bathing. And it's dead sea salt. And the title sounds pretty gruesome. But this is just an incredible product. It softens and soothes dry itchy skin. It supports natural skin healing as you can see on the pack and it is suitable for use on skin prone to eczema and psoriasis. This is just an amazing product for if you've got very irritant skin when it comes to products, or if there's no soap or no like body gel that works on you because it just irritates your skin, then I would 100% recommend this because it won't irritate your skin. You just put like maybe a handful, a handful and a half into your bath water whilst it's pouring and it absorbs into the water and makes your skin feel incredible. And it's so good for you and it has no obviously added ingredients ingredients that we don't know about. It's just like a pure cleaner which really cleans everything about your whole body. So definitely try this out. I honestly think it's one of the best products I've bought when it comes to body care because you really know that it's something natural and good that's going into your body. Okay so the next two items are kind of the same but I just have to mention them because oh my god I've been loving them this month especially around the fall time because they are candles. And the first one I got this mini candle stick holder and it's just this glass 
candlestick holder and it looks so vintage and so chic it's just incredible i just absolutely love it and i also got the candlesticks in a huge pack from ikea so i can just keep restocking it when it goes down i just absolutely love this i think it makes my room look a lot more vintage i would definitely recommend it because it can just add so much to a blank space so yeah, that's what I've been loving. Oh my god, this next thing is honestly one of my all-time favourite things I've ever bought, which is pretty sad because it's it's just a candle. <laughs> it is a three-wick candle and it's quite big. I've got another huge one, which I haven't used yet, so I can't use that in a recommendation roundup because it could smell horrible. But this one I have been lighting like every single night and oh my god it smells of vanilla i just did not know how good vanilla could taste <laughs> and i just did not know how good vanilla could smell until i lit this candle it just makes my room smell like literal heaven i don't really know what to say it's amazing and this particular candle was like four pounds literally four pounds it is just incredible i absolutely love it and it's just the nicest candle I've ever had, I'm gonna have to go back and restock because it just smells of vanilla and it brings a really autumny, autumnal feeling to my room and yeah, I'm really excited. The last thing I got, let me just, <sighs> we need an appreciation sigh for these shoes. I saw these like small black boots with an embroidered like flowery feature on the side on New Look's website and they were like 35 pounds. So I was like, I don't really know whether to get these or not because it's a lot of money and I don't know whether I'm going to wear them a lot. But I found like a New Look voucher which took £10 off so they were only £24.99 and oh my god I just had to get them and my dad brought them home today and oh I love these shoes so much. I'll just show them here as well because they just deserve it, you know? These are the shoes. Oh my god. Can't do this. Look at them. I'm sorry, but how beautiful are these? These need a YouTube channel on their own because I mean, oh my god, look. Look at that flower embroidery. It's absolutely gorgeous and so subtle. Look at this heel at the back as well. It's like legit. I just I feel like if these were real, I would go into a relationship with them. I just can't wait to wear these because oh if you can't tell already, I really like them. So yeah. Well guys, those are all my recommendation roundups. Okay guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it or if you liked any of the items I mentioned. And remember to hit the little red subscribe button under the video because that would just mean a lot to me and it would show me that you enjoy my content and want me to keep creating more. Also on the outro I do, you can just click my face and it will automatically take you to where you can subscribe. So thank you so much again for watching. I really enjoyed this and yeah, I will catch you in the next one. Guys, I just realized when I next upload, it will be my 21st birthday. Ah! <laughs> okay, bye.